dryer. Take them out of the dryer and put them, fold them and put them in the bag. That's easy shit, but we can't even get past step one. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Even fucking put them shits in the washer? What the fuck, what the fuck are you doing? I'm fucking hard working here. <laughs> yeah! Come on. Like, fuck! And I'm lazy as fuck. And you lazy as fuck! <laughs> I just can't. I have itis. <laughs> you got itis, bro, all over. Yes, man. I had itis last night. I need a full bag of chips, bro. Ow! Bro! Out to the world. Thirty minutes. Oh, come on, that's too much. Oh, and Pancho llamó. Finally, he called last night. Um, I couldn't talk to him because I was doing something church. Pero qué bueno que está vivo. Glad he's alive. I don't know. I just I'm just glad. This Indio, Southern California, USA. Oh, planet Earth. Oh, uh, vamos a ir a hacer algo with the clothes. A lot of clothes, Jesus. Pero cuando ve que el pacho es que se venga, 
Que se venga y ya. Que se venga. Before it's too late. Because of the virus. Oh, look, a tumbleweed. Golly, it's so pretty. That's una bola de, de puro. Oh, look at this. A big old tumbleweed. Uh, security cameras in use. Oh, it's so easy. That tumbleweed. <laughs> Oh, I hate that barbed wire. Oh, my Lord. No. No, not yet. Not yet. Send her a text for me and say, suck my dick. Oh, Lord. You, you better do that part. <laughs> she texted me last night. She said, look, I'm going to no harm. I said, well, when you come to get me, you know it is. We're fucking in the front door. Oh, Lord. Windows down in the back seat. You need a screamer. Oh, no. Hey, Betty. Ah! Nobody here. I think that's pretty good, but I don't think I'll do 10 minutes, but I just like recording. Wish there was some money around here. That'd be cool. Out of service. A ver, ¿qué pasa? Pero te, ya, ya le llamé el Pancho en la mañana y todavía no, no contesta. Ojalá que esté vivo el güey. No, es con que esté vivo ya. Con que le diga te amo, te quiero, vente por acá abajo ya. Gracias a Dios y ten cuidado allá arriba. Still hot out here. Got it going on. A soda, huh? A big old soda with ice. Yeah, Coke. A cherry Coke. Yeah, mix it up. Well, make sure you drink it before you get to the. <laughs> so the part the other guys don't see it. Fuck them. Drink that shit in front of them. Yeah, in front of them. <laughs> oh, no. It's gonna. How do you think? It's gonna slip out of your hands because. back door? I put this in, in the pocket. Oh, right here. Yeah, and I'm gonna slip out of their hand.
We just watched the hair fall out the window. Yeah, don't work like that. I'm not sure if it works like that with you. How do you get in touch to say you're losing friends, family, people closest to you at the minute? Do you know what? These times, it's going to happen. Do you know why? Because it's like being a tiger among a herd of sheep. It's like being an eagle among pigeons. You just got to ask yourself what you'd prefer to be. Uh, hair right here you're going to be night. part of the herd. Yeah, you're going to be a tiger. You're going to be oh, a pigeon. Lord. You're going to be an eagle. Yeah, wow. What's that going to mean? Well, eagles don't fly with pigeons. Oh. Tigers don't hang out with sheep. That's just Black the way that it juice. is. And you're going to find that you're going to naturally grow know, apart from some people. Hair. Do you know why? Well, when I think back to oh, yeah. when I was watching the news every yeah, day and in taking in every little bit of information like gospel when i was uh, watching the saturday day, night tv and listening to clips yeah. 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 there i can't Virtue it won't bleed. Those times yeah. feels like strength no. maybe it's like bravery at times i don't know if those brand new or someone shaking their fucking nuts with yeah. this when you start to have a little bit more of that, you start to see things. Huh? You were using a used razor. I don't know. No, you got to be careful with those. You might see that, and it might be through lack of awareness and through a little bit more education and patience. You might want to try just a little bit. That's completely up to you, but that takes a lot of patience. But there's a lot of people that want to keep eating that steak. Reference to the Matrix there, right? They want to keep jumping down said, uh, on, on that stake, and no matter what driving, you try and do, nothing's going to gonna drive my car? seem to work. Yeah. I said, and with those type car. of people, <laughs> oh, yeah? you can take them aside. You can say, look, <laughs> hey, she maybe said, stop, try not to be so lazy. Maybe care, do a little bit of research beyond insurance. what you hear on the yeah. BBC. Oh. Um, but you know, you very little yeah, response from that. There's something else you can try. That's fuck fuck off. Off. I'm gonna stop for the cops. Oh, okay. Okay. He said, uh, yeah, you do. We're fucking square bears now. It's in yeah. your nature to rest from square more. bears. Was that when you stop? Nerds. Them? Yeah. Well, shit, bro. If you don't, they gonna it's push your ass down. down. They won't catch me. I'm telling you, the motherfuckers will shoot your ass down. Tire strips the fuck out you. <laughs> they can't right. catch me in a Honda Civic. Oh yeah, no. Be careful. Because the way police do with motherfuckers now. Everybody Three. Good evening, everybody. I'm Martha McCallum in New York, and this is the story as it plays out mm -hmm. tonight across America. President Trump's first term bookended by calling out carnage in America. Here he is today mm -hmm. announcing a surge of federal law enforcement officers that will go to Chicago and Albuquerque for now, perhaps more places later, followed by the words of two Americans who lost innocent loved ones to this violence. No mother should ever have to cradle her dead child in her arms simply because politicians Oops. refuse to do what is necessary. For this reason today, I am announcing that the Department of 